All right, so here's a fun little backstory. Adam the Woo and I kind of snuck into this old amusement park. It's one of the first amusement parks in America, actually. Most of the park was already kind of destroyed by the time we snuck in, but you get the idea. I used to sneak in here all the time as a kid. You know, as you do, you're a mischievous little jerkhead kid. And we had an old amusement park that was right here. And that used to be the entrance. Well, it used to be the entrance for the park when it was, you know, up and operating. It opened in August 15th, 1955. Enchanted Forest, Maryland Storybook Park, opened to the public. Around the same time Disneyland opened, which is kind of insane. I think there was like a maybe a couple weeks difference between the two of them opening. So I was doing some spring cleaning, cleaning out some hard drives, and I came across some old interesting footage I shot with Adam the Woo. And I thought it'd be kind of fun to put together like a retro style vlog using a combination of old footage, new footage, and using a collection of cameras. Adam came and visited me a couple years ago. I'm not entirely sure what year he came. This was around the RV year, so. And I was like, let's go check out Enchanted Forest because he had been here before many years prior. And I'm like, well, we got to go back. So I took him over here. As you can see, they, they gated up this whole area. When Adam and I came, it was wide open. An old amusement park used to be there. You can kind of see a little remnants of it right there. You'd walk in the main entrance down this path and straight into what is now overgrown in the woods, but check it out there. There's some of the old walkways still remaining. And walked right down there and in there. This is pre please stop vlogging Kenny vlog footage. Back when he didn't know what he was doing, he still doesn't know what he's doing. But not all of them, obviously, because they're quite a bit. Oh my gosh, look at that. That's like, like the top of a castle point there. There where that big pile of debris now is. Man, that's cool. If they come, we'll just leave. Huh? If, they, if anybody comes, it's like, well, oh, sorry. Hey, that would be Crybaby starring Johnny Depp. They filmed some shots out here. Johnny Depp stood. Look, there's a lot of planes going by. If you are familiar with the John Waters movie Crybaby, they filmed quite a few scenes out here on this property. Think about it. Johnny Depp stood right there. Or right there. Well, he, he stood somewhere out here, uh, most likely. Going down to the top. And for those who don't know, Adam and I met when I made a documentary on him back in, who maybe like 2013, 2014 or so. I drove down to Florida with a couple of my friends we met him at an abandoned uh, racetrack, I think, or like a drag strip in Tallahassee, Florida. Filmed him, asked him some questions, made the documentary. But yeah, this is bringing back some fun memories. Fun memories when I was, you know, a bad kid. I would come here and film things. I filmed like a black and white, like on actual film for one of my student projects, like film 102 or something like that. I wish I could find that footage. It was lost in a hard drive. Hard drive failure. Always back up your footage, kids. <laughs> yes, this is the kind of stuff I get excited about. Pieces of theming that have not been destroyed. Yes. Holding strong. There's a lot of...
more I look at this area, I'm starting to think they did not say as much as I read in articles online. There is a lot. Back when I was in maybe high school or so, there's a couple ways you could sneak into the side. And they had a lot more things back here. And I'll explain to you what they did with those old storybook structures. Cool. Yeah. Oh God. Oh my God. Something horrific happened over here. Oh, oh my God, there's even more st This is a bad omen? I don't want any part of this. This, what in the world is happening back over in Enchanted Forest? I gotta, I gotta get out of here. There is an actual structure still remaining. And it's behind the bamboo. Whoa! Did you hear that? Did you hear that noise? Yeah. What was that? I don't know. Was that a bear? Holy cow, what is that? Dude, there's something in there. <laughs> you can't be. I don't think we have bears around here. Dude, that was terrifying. Dude, there's something in that freaking thing. It's gotta be a raccoon. Or a fox or something. It sounded big. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Dude, it was coming after it, whatever it was. Oh wow, I'm in this other parking lot over here. I was up there before. You can kind of see another side of park. Yeah, so you see this big kind of brown structure? That's a water slide. That's the last thing that's in there. I guess it's just too hard to get out. Ugh. So in the early 2000s, they began to restore a lot of enchanted forests and move it to this new location, Clark's Elliott Oak Farm. Explanation of the restoration process. It took quite a few years to move some other relics over to where they are now located. opened in 2002. Actually, I think that is the original, original entrance. And maybe that's a recreation over there. I believe that was the original sign, too.
all original souvenirs. Tractor A ride going on, and there's the shoe. That was one of the original ones? Yes, that was one of the original buildings. The Three Bears, Goldilocks, and I believe you, there's even little Goldilocks and the Three Bears in there. Yeah. Oh my god, the, this bear, I guess, killed this hunter and now has mounted him onto the wall. Nailed it. So I think these guys are from the original park. I've seen pictures of them in the background in front of one of the main castles. Uh, who is this guy? Not interested in me because I don't have food. No, 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 no. What do you want? Only provide pets. <sighs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my. God. I will lose my freaking mind if I can hold a baby goat. How old? This one is two days old. Two days old? Oh my gosh. You're adorable. That one over there, too little to hold? Nope. That one's good. Can I hold that one? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. That was one of the greatest moments of my life right there. My God. The baby, baby cows. Donkey. Oh my God. Gentle. Say, say a prayer for this little boy. Sensor, some of that stuff over there. Ooh, I'm not gonna lie. I don't really remember a lot of like little fairy tales from my childhood. The dish and the spoon. I'm sure a lot of people out there know this. I don't remember any of this stuff. Hey diddle diddle, the cat and the fiddle, the cow jumped over the moon. I, I remember briefly about this. Okay, I kind of know where the story's going. The little dog laughed to see such sport and the dish ran away with the spoon. Yeah. It's a lot more interesting now to come back and look at this stuff because when I was here with Adam, I was filming him filming the stuff. Oh man, that's a lot of wind. Oh, that's a lot of wind. 
back in 2017 with Adam, I was just filming him, filming the stuff and just watching him kind of take it all in. But now, I can take it in. I don't know where this thing is from. Maybe my nightmares. It's horrific. Lil Toot, the boat, and outside of the water, what are you doing out of the, you should be in the water. Willie the whale, can you survive on land? Whoa, who is that inside his, inside his throat there? This must be Yoda? So a lot of these storybook features are either a combination of reclaimed and restored things from the original Enchanted Forest, and some of them have been made uh, exclusively for this park. Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh good god, no. That one's just, that, I don't know what's in there. That's terrifying. Oh, it's weird. It's so weird. I guess you're supposed to like use your imagination. You can kind of see where the fairies are. Like, hey, they're on that little swing or they're in a house. I think it's time for me to leave. I'm freaking out. Like I'm trying to take video of stuff and I hear something crinkling behind me. It's just a bird, but is it? I don't know what's in these woods. I'm not trying to mess with a fairy kingdom, fairy nightmare. Stepped into the most bizarre maze. It looks like these are the kind of flags you'd see in a used car lot, except it's they're dangling and festooning the trees. I don't even know how to get through here. It's a, it legitimately is a maze. Ing. At Disneyland, you can sit in a teacup, but here, you can sit inside a tea kettle. Punk, rock a bye, baby, in the treetop. Well, that's the baby, and that's the treetop. Rocket. Serves you right. Arrogant, right there. So arrogant, and look who won. That's right. You did it. Oh, don't fall for it, Red Riding Hood. That's not your grandma. Now, I thought I overheard some kids saying that there was a SpongeBob in this area. I'm not seeing any SpongeBob. I'm seeing Hansel and Gretel. They're about to be burned alive. Right? Gingerbread? I don't know what the story is. Somebody somebody dies in one of these things. Grim story fairy tales. It's a gingerbread house. Gingerbread house, right? There's a gingerbread house for Jack and Jill. Oh, there's Patrick. There must be a SpongeBob around here somewhere. Holy crap, here he is. What are, what are you doing here? My god, they were right. SpongeBob is here. SpongeBob is here. I'm not gonna lie, I have no clue what this is. I'm this isn't a bit, I'm not pretending. Mary Mary quite 
contrary. How does your garden grow with silver bells and cockle shells and pretty maids all in a row? I don't, I don't know. Wait a minute. I thought those are his eyes for a second. That's those are his peepers right there. Those are his glasses. I was like, oh my god, look at that. But then you see that, and you're like, okay. I got to do more stuff on this place. I think there's a whole fun little documentary just waiting to be documented. <laughs>